Welcome to Your Health. Information about today's top health topics direct from Brigham and Women's Hospital experts. We want to remind you that this information should not replace the advice or recommendations from your health care provider. I'm Pat O'Gara, member of the cardiovascular division, and we're here today to talk about your cardiovascular health. If you have a family history of heart disease, I think it's right for you to be a bit concerned about what your risk is of developing heart disease. You know, we used to think that your risk of having a heart problem was really quite high if either your mother or father had a heart issue when they were younger. But more recent research has shown us that if a brother or sister of yours has had a heart disease event, that you're really at much higher risk for the same problem. So when we think about family histories of heart disease, we do have to think quite broadly with respect to all of those things that could affect the function or even the structure of your heart. Most of the folks who come to see us are concerned because a close relative has had a heart attack or a stroke or may have high blood cholesterol or diabetes. When you see your doctor, he or she will ask you several questions about your family's heart disease. Most importantly, they will want to know, in your own words, what type of heart disease your family member may have had. You're going to want to review with your primary care physician whether or not he or she thinks you have the kind of problem that merits evaluation by a heart specialist. Cardiologists can rely on a series of questions and some very simple tests that can be done during your first visit such as an electrocardiogram or some blood work uh, and on occasion an echocardiogram in addition to a careful physical examination. And these kinds of details can give us an appreciation of the risk that you might face for developing a similar problem. If there are things about how you're feeling that worry you, that you are either at risk for a heart problem or you know you have a heart problem and you just don't feel as if things are going as well as you would like, then it's very helpful for you to seek the advice and counsel of a heart specialist to put things in perspective and to make sure that you're doing whatever you need to do to know all about the problem and to take the precautions that you need to prevent the problem from getting worse and making sure you're on the right kind of treatment. Thanks for watching Your Health from Brigham and Women's Hospital. A reminder, Your Health is intended for educational purposes only. It should not take the place of advice or recommendations from your health care provider. If you have questions about what you've heard, please consult with your doctor.